Talk to me about wiring, the coloring, and what do they mean? Okay, well that's actually a, a quite a common question we get on our website is, what are the colors of the wire? I've removed this receptacle, I forgot to write down how it was hooked up, what are the colors and what do they mean? Mm -hmm. So, when you got to, the most important thing about electrical, when you're do, working on electrical, is make sure there's a good ground. Okay, mm -hmm. so ground, grounding conductors are always green or bare. So like in this instance here, you see it's a bare copper wire. Okay. Always your ground. White is always your grounded conductor and the neutral conductor. It's always no, also known as a neutral. And, uh, and that's not always the case. There are some exceptions to a white conductor having power on it. Mm -hmm. But basically, white, neutral, bare or green ground. And the hot colors are black or red or black, red and blue in a three-phase system. Okay. But in your house, you're only going to find red, black, white, and green or bare for ground. Okay. Now let's talk about electrical devices and changing them. Okay. Well, Give like, us some tips on, let's say, receptacles first off. Okay. Well, as you see, there's one broken on the board, and we could be changing that because that's a, a safety hazard. Your, mm -hmm. your devices will start to fit loose in them and uh, could fall out or electrocute yourself when you're pulling it out if it's loose and you grab onto the prong. So mm -hmm. if you want to replace a receptacle like that, you'd pull it out and you'd see much like this. Of course, you've made sure the power was off as we mm -hmm. talked about before. Wait, how do you pull it out? Because I actually pull mine out like this. That's wrong, right? Well, as long as you know the power is out. But actually, it's always a good practice to assume everything is hot. Right. Even though you've shut the breaker off and you're sure of it, assume it's hot and you should grab it by the tabs because they're grounded. You're grounded and you shouldn't get a shock from a grounded conductor. So pull the receptacle out. Mm -hmm. You'll notice on uh, receptacles, brass is black. Mm -hmm. So that's the hot side. And your green and silver is on the white side, or the white is on the silver side, I should say. Now, when you're taking a receptacle off, you should always take off the hots first, mm -hmm. the neutrals next, and last the ground. And same way in reverse, when you put on the new receptacle, ground first, then the neutral, spin it over and put your hot wires on. Okay, well if you're going to change your receptacle, a lot of the times you're going to change your switch as well. Is the same technique used with this? Yeah, just on, on switches, it, it could be a number of ways they're wired, like I discussed earlier, where white can sometimes be hot. So sometimes you'll open up a switch and you'll find a white and a black on it. Mm -hmm. So it doesn't really matter on a single pole switch, which is up and which is on the bottom and which is on the top. So uh, with a switch, you just make sure you know which two were on it, remove those, cut and strip it and put your new device on.